Hi, and welcome back to Tier 10 to Prem. This is the final season, and here we are today, starting off the start of our Premier League season, and hopefully retaining that Champions League. But it all starts today in the Premier League, and we have got Leicester City. Okay, so here we are today, first game of the season, starting off home to Leicester City. And it's Rodriguez in goal, Simon, Leighton and Bellman's Horton Gore as your back four. Leighton has been recommended above Montes. That's interesting, very interesting indeed. Geflin, Powell, Raphael as your midfield three. And as you're attacking three of the diamond, Timote, Gibson and Think. It's just such a beautiful team, isn't it? Fingers crossed we can go on and win another league. We should be winning this one fairly comfortably. Play your own game and we'll win. It's Leicester City, man. OK, if that's what you say, Jake, I'm happy with that. Starman Gibson. According to that, in our previous game, they've got a couple of players bringing in from their previous match. A few changes. It's the first day of the season, and off we jolly well go. And here come the boys. Can we start off like a house on fire like we did in that first game in the league? league in the charity shield community shield whatever you want to call it we did play well gotta say that we did play well and today it's the turn of leicester city to try and knock us off our perch and it is leicester with the first highlight and it goes over the bar and like i was saying earlier on it will be the last season this season we are uh Definitely calling it a day at the end of this season. It's time to start focusing on FM22, that is for sure. I am intrigued to see what this new match engine is going to look like. This new ulterior version they've done, whatever they've done. Look at that, look, they've even got a back three already. They're already playing it. I can't see me playing for it at the back. I did do it years ago as a manager when I was playing. But we will see Horton Gore, Alex Raphael. Horton Gore gets it back to the byline. Gibson, the keeper, saves it. And it's Steele, of course, the England international in goal for them. He has been a quality goalkeeper over the years. 31 years old now. £53 million pounds worth. Rodriguez... £50 million. Pounds. These two are the best two goalkeepers in the world. Says it all, really. Come on, boys. It's a very flat game. We've had seven chances. They've had one. And they are taking risks at the back. Alex Raphael picks up the ball. Timothy to Powell. Powell coming forward. Bit of a powder puff shot. Powell isn't yet a world-class player. He's still only three stars on that respect. And it is half-time. Yestin Powell has been the best player on the pitch. Give the fans something, what they're expecting. I quite agree with that. I like that. And it's Simon to Gibson. Back to Simon. Gibson gets into the middle. Powell to Alex Raphael, Horton Gore, who's been booked now, straight at the England goalkeeper. Got to do better than that, son. Um, Julian Think, you're World Player of the Year, son. What's going on? Geflin as well, look. Bellmans is having a shocker. He's coming off before he causes any troubles. Horton Gore is another one who's been booked, who's a possibility. 
Can we get this ball back, please? They got a three at the back. Think, Julian Think latches onto the ball. And that's why he is so, so deadly. What a player, Julian Think. Three at the back. They didn't know what to do with him. Edwards, our ex-player. And finally, we've got a goal. Right. Time to make some changes as well. He says. And it is Edwards who's come back to haunt us. Look at him going in the corner. You absolute. Right. Geflin is starting to play better. And it's Leicester again. Let's fire these boys up. Half an hour to go. You've got another couple of minutes, boys, and I'm making some changes. And it gas me again. It's causing us problems. Oh, and Rodriguez makes the save. It says it would have been a great goal. And it is gas me again. And it is Edwards again. Oh, dear. <laughs> this season might not be going the way that we hope. We're currently bottom of the league. Right. Changes afoot. Simon. Let's give him a rest. Um, Gibson. For Keenan Sinclair. On you come, son. It's a demand more. It's fired the boys up. Got 6.6s right through the back four here. Shocking. Absolutely shocking today. Let's go a bit more attacking. Let's see what happens. Because we are playing... We're being FM'd. <laughs> 0.22. for us. It's aberration. Come on, boys. That's fired them up. That's the one. Got this horrible nose cold coming on. It's, no, of course it's nose cold. Horrible blocked up nose. It is not what we need. Not feeling at my best. And we're not playing at our best. And we've got anxious players now. Fire up for the last few minutes. And it is going to be a defeat for the first game of the season to Leicester City. Jarvis Morgan. This is the first time in a long time. Sanchez to Geflin. Geflin to Alex Raphael. Sanchez. Keenan Sinclair. Point to prove. Timote. And it's away. And it's Gazmi again. And Gazmi puts it into the side netting. But he's run the ball all the way up the other end of the pitch. We're into added on time. On to added on time. Sanchez. Sanchez coming forward. He is busting the gut to get there. He's been absolutely annihilated there by the player. And we've still got another chance. Alex Raphael, ball in. And steal the goalie from another planet. And there you go, look. Absolutely and utterly football managed. Far from pleased. Far from pleased. And let's get on for the second game. Bottom of the league. Next game is Porto in the Euro Super Cup. So here we are for the Porto game in the European Super Cup. And one change from the previous game. Sanchez has come in for Simon, who is out for four weeks with a twisted ankle in training. Oh, not what we needed. So off we go and play in the Super Cup. And I'm not going with the fans. We're going to go out there. 
my favourites here. Go give the fans a performance. That's the one. Where are we? We're in Prague. We're out in Prague. Paddy McNair is the FC Porto manager. Wow. Is that a future role for him, maybe? And here we come. The Super Cup. This would be a nice one to add to the uh, portfolio, that is for sure. And they're playing pretty much a flat back seven. And it's Timotei. Ball in, just past the post. They're in a dark... They're in black and we're in dark blue. I'm not... Got a problem with colours normally, but those two are very, very similar in this game. But we shall see. We shall see. Bit of encouragement after nine minutes. Horton Gore. Ball forward to Gethlin. Gethlin back to Horton Gore. Horton Gore, Gibson. Sandy Gibson. Pops up with his first goal of the season. And it is 1-0 in the 10th minute. Just after that bit of encouragement. That's what we like to see. Horton Gore with the throw to Gethlin. Who gives it straight back to him. Horton Gore goes past one. And Gibson with his left foot. 1-0. Beautiful. 11 minutes on the clock. Julian Think again is having a bit of a quiet game. But at least we're on the score sheet today. Sanchez 6.9 there. Look, he is really turning into that right back that we really, really have missed over the years. £48 million worth now. Yestin Powell. Sanchez back to Powell. Sanchez again into Alex Raphael. Horton Gore has a pop. Not this time, though. And you would think they're 1 0 down. You'd think they'd get rid of this flat back seven they've got. And they have got the lad that we had playing for us Karim Sabah, who signed for Porto for £60 million. Was it or something crazy? Yes, Tim Powell's having a quiet game, 6.6 .6 in there. Leighton, again, another one, a 6.6. .6. This is not what we want to see. And it is Porto with a highlight. Gefflin, cracking challenge. And Julian Think, Gibson Powell for his first goal of the season. And that all come from Gefflin. Gefflin's challenge here, Think... Ball in, Timotei almost, think, gets to it. Gibson has a go, Powell into an empty net. It's 2-0 on 33 minutes. Beautiful football, beautiful. And that, from Leopold Gefflin, was an absolute cracking challenge. That's exactly what we need from him. And you'd think that challenge would have pushed him up above a 7 not today, though. And it's now Porto on the attack. Ball swung in, and it is a reply from Samuel Sarr. And it is now 2-1. Just coming up to half-time. And that's two goals in ten minutes there. They've had a few spells. You can see they've had a bit of, bit of play there. Are we going to be football managed again? I've not had the game on for four or five days. Ooh, and that was close. That was close. Leighton is not playing well again. Just wondering, because we've turned the game off, whether uh, football managers wondering why we haven't been uh, playing. It's because I've made a few videos in advance. And then we're uh, we're now back. We've had a few days off, we've had a few few days away, a bit of a break. Yestin Powell, he smashes one over the bar. Paddy McNair up there, the ex-Man United player. And Horton Gore didn't even challenge for that. Alex Raphael, is he going to get a challenge in? I don't think so. This is one of those days today, a bit like the Leicester game. Leighton does get away. Timotei to think. Julian Think coming down the wing. They've got an abundance of players back. Oh, 
thought that was in. Julian Think puts it wide, though. And I think we will shore up that defence late and off for Montes. We've got a 12-man bench today. Ridiculous. Balls away. Is that Gefflin again? Horton Gore. Timotei. Timotei to Powell. Powell forward. Think. Wins it. Ball in again. Is he offside? They've given it. He's delighted with it. It's 3-1 on 51 minutes. He did look a bit offside, to be honest. Yestin Powell forward to Think. Gibson. Oh, I'm still not convinced. Are they going to bring up the lines? They are. Let's have a little look here a minute. Oh, no. Left back and right back, both of them well back. And hopefully it's not going to be an instant reply from Porto now that we've just got our two-goal advantage back again. And Gibson has nicked the ball. Sandy Gibson... Oh, nearly. Oh, Sanchez. I thought he was going to do something special with that then. Bellman's. I think that's the first time we've spoke about his name in the game so far. Ball pump forward all the way to Rodriguez. Yes, Tim Powell picks up the loose ball. Powell breaking through the midfield to Julian Think. Keeper makes a save. It's a corner. Timotei in. Montes over the bar. Unlucky son. Right. We could make a whole raft of changes here, but it will be the midfield. We're going to give him a break. Altinio. Alex Raphael. Where is... There he is. Cecilio. I'm not sure if we can make any more changes in this, but we can't. Unfortunately, I'd like to take more off. Here's the Super Cup. You'd think we'd be able to make... It's a bit like a friendly, isn't it? Really? Drop some praise, I think. Well done, boys. I'm happy so far. 3-1 up. It's another bit of silverware. Three different goal scorers. Beautiful, beautiful football. I would like to be able to take another player off, but... Unfortunately, not today. But it's uh, Porto again starting the highlight with 20 minutes to go. And Rodriguez, whether he was a bit deceived by that ball, I'm not sure. Sanchez now on the ball, out wide into Timotei. Timotei running with the ball back to Sanchez, who's followed the run through. Horton Gore gets it. Bellman's back to Horton Gore. Cecilio, Cecilio out to Sanchez again. Sanchez coming down the wing. Gibson back to Sanchez. Sanchez to the byline. Gibson trying to get the ball in. Sanchez, Timotei, Cecilio with his second goal of the season. Eltinio set it up for him. What a goal. So many times with knocking on the door, diving in challenges. Sanchez, Timotei. Eltinio, Cecilio, right in the postage stamp. Right across, cut it across the goalkeeper. It's now 4-1. Absolutely stunning. Stunning football. Praise. I'm delighted with you boys. I'm absolutely delighted. Add into that silverware, 29 efforts to their five. An XG of 2.61. Cecilio. Oh, nearly. Bellman's picks up loose ball out wide. Puts it back in. Just gets smashed away. Horton Gore. Forward to think. Timotei. Now to Horton Gore again. Horton Gore to think. Sandy's in the, in the middle. He's gone for goal again. And it's just hit the keeper in the legs. Unbelievable. Unbelievable from the player, world player of the year. Julian Fink. What a player. In fact, let's just revel in it. Look at his stats. 17s, 17s, 18s, 16s, loads of 16s. 
18 for acceleration, 17 for pace. Oh, he's just an absolute superstar. He is an absolute superstar. We've got plenty of them, though. He's another one. And there's more trophies, boys and girls. Thank you very much. And Horton Gore comes forward to pick up the trophy. And it is the European Super Cup. Winners. Wow. Thank you very much. Oh, yes. Stunning, stunning game. And Rodriguez, let's have his little cartwheel, please. There it is. Absolutely stunning. There's Horton Gore. It's a pity you can't click on him. Just to get him to do another little animation or something. Sandy Gibson, man of the match. Congratulations, boys. Beautiful, beautiful football. Right. I think because we've played so poorly in that game, we're going to do two more home games. We're going to do Wolves off camera and then we're going to do Leeds and Arsenal. Well, boys and girls, we are now the proud owners or winners of the European Super Cup. It's another bit of silverware. But thank you very much for watching. If you did like it, please get those thumbs up. We do appreciate every single view, comment, comments. That's what we need. Get some comments in down, please. Plenty of views. Loads of you are watching the channel at the moment. It's absolutely amazing the amount of views we're getting. But let's have some more comments, please. Thank you very much. We'll see you in the next one.